Hello and welcome to tribetopper.com. In this video on important questions on binomial expansion from the past papers. So our question says, given that 1 plus 2 upon 3x whole to the power n times 3 plus nx whole square is equal to 9 plus 84x plus so on, find the value of n. Now we have to focus on the first term this bracket 1 plus 2 by 3x raised to the power n because we have to do binomial expansion only for this. The second bracket is just a whole square so we'll open it as a square later. Now what will be the expansion of 1 plus 2 by 3x whole to the power n? We already know that we started like this the first term would be n c 0 and into 1 to the power n plus next term would be n c 1 into 1 to the power n minus 1 and 2 by 3 x and plus so on. We will not actually bother much to calculate or determine the next terms because we are given only to solve it in 9 plus 84 x. We have nothing to compare for x square. So we will not go uh, for expansion beyond this. So we are done. The first term is just 1 because n c 0 is 1 and 1 to the power anything is 1. So 1 plus n c 1 means n factorial. We will open it a little one step backward. n factorial can be written as n into n minus 1 factorial upon 1 factorial into n minus 1 factorial, right? I suppose you already know this thing. Into 1 to the power n minus 1 is still 1 into 2 by 3x. Solving all this we get what we have to do is just cancel out n minus 1 factorial and n minus 1 factorial. So the result of the expansion is this n minus 1 and n minus 1 cancels out and you are just left with 1 plus 2 by 3 nx. So 1 is this term and plus solving all this you get. So 1 plus 2 by 3 nx. Now we are going to just multiply all of this with the other bracket. The second bracket is 3 plus nx whole square. So we will open the terms whole square but we are concerned only with the term with the single power of x. So we will just focus on that. So 1 plus 2 by 3 nx. We are going to multiply this with 3 plus nx whole square gives 9 plus 6nx plus n square x square. Now we are not going to focus on the terms which contain x square. So now what am I going to do? Just multiply 1 with 9 that gives me 9. 1 multiply with 6nx gives me plus 6nx. I am not going to consider the term with n square x square because that is not of my concern. Then 2 by 3 nx multiplied with 9. So plus 2 by 3 nx multiplied with 9 and we are not going to multiply further we don't need that right so we'll just leave it as dots because we don't need the terms which contain x square now the first term is 9 plus this will cancel out 3 and 3 so 3 2s are 6 6 nx gives you 12 nx so the expansion result on the left hand side is 9 plus 12 nx and that is equal to supposed to be 9 plus 84 x plus so on as given to us. So 9 9 cancels 12 n x is equal to 84 x. So we will just do it here on a side 12 n x the result is 12 n x is equal to 84 x therefore what is n equal to 84 by 12 and that is 7 because 12 times 7 is 84. So we have found out the value of n. I hope this video is helpful and you have understood how to solve this. Please follow us on Instagram, Facebook and Twitter at tribetopper.com.